Hello everyone, this is Direwolf20, and... This is... Palmar! Googly Mar. Welcome to episode 3 of Sky Factory. What's up, buddy? We're just, uh, smashing some stone, getting some dust. Yeah, that cobble gun thing is pretty nice, huh? I like that I'm no longer doing manual labor, except that I'm just doing different manual labor. So that's cool. Slave Master 20. What's that now? I mean, what? Do what now? I'm not a Slave Master. I don't know what you're talking about. You know what I'm gonna make? No, but you're gonna tell me. Oh, yeah. What's up? You made a sword. Making a sword. Swords for the win. Uh, I'm cooking up a bunch of charcoal at the moment and grout. So that I can make a smeltery. Love tiny charcoal. Have I mentioned lately how much I love tiny charcoal? No, but uh, why don't you tell me? It's great. It's tiny and it's charcoal, and it works really well for all things. You heard this. Uh, you heard it here first, people. Tiny charcoal is Direwolf Twenty approved. Yeah, no, it's one hundred percent. It's it's a great thing. Dude, we're getting some pretty good dust. Right? Where should we put our smeltery, do you think? Um, I'm thinking like in this general area, I'll extend here and, and build out a smeltery. Sleepy W. Sleepy no. Come on, let him, let him set his stuff. He's died so many times. Um, it should set your stuff automatically. To do seven my you life know, away. It's what you do on a skyblock. At least we're not twerking anymore. I know. Nobody wanted to see that. I mean, we could if we wanted to. We don't. I think our special guest is really going to enjoy the twerking mechanic. I know. It's going to be hilarious. Whenever said special guest arrives. That'd be easy. You know how it is, man. Do I ever? You do. By the way, you're aware that it that's not lit up. I'm I'm working on it. I'm making tiny torches as we speak, sir. Be right with you. All done. You can have it now. Dude. Dude. What? Bro. Bro, bro what? Dude, bro. I don't know what you're saying anymore. I'm bro, not even dude. sure if you're happy or upset with me. I 
I'm still getting crazy food saturation from eating like a single silkworm. It's nice, isn't it? I'm gonna need more grout, I think. Can I have that compressed gravel? You mind if I take that? Thank you, There's sir. Some sand too. Oh yeah, I'll definitely take the sand. Yeah, you know what I want. Could you not say it like that? Ho oh, hum. Oh, by the way, don't smelt any um any stuff yet. I've held myself back from it. Cool. Here, you can have this uh, gravel back, by the way. Yeah, because the, the smeltery I'm making will allow us to dupe it, like double it. We do need to smelt one thing, though, because we need to make a cast for an ingot. Yeah. Or no, you can cast right into a block and then from the block in an ingot. Do what now? I remember these things. Well, when you make your casting basin, you could just have it cast the block, right? Uh, probably. Like a block in the metal. Whoa, you're water laddering. Yeah, I am. Like a champ. Thought I heard you drown. I mean, news of my death is greatly exaggerated, Bob Mar. You read that on a website somewhere, didn't you? Probably. So at what point do we build the mob spawner? Whenever you want. You should look at vector plates. Oh, we need slime balls and sugar, although we do have sugar cane. Sugar cane grows better on sand, right? Uh, it grows even better on snad. On what? Snad. What, what, what is snad? Snad is snad. There you go. better on snad I can't even function now like I'm broken I forgot what I was doing <laughs> I broke Pahama everybody um I guess I gotta find a place to put my snad yeah I, I think the origin of that mod is that 
it's always been rumored that sugarcane grows faster on sand, but it doesn't. So somebody made a mod where it grows faster on sand. But instead of like updating sand mechanics, they just decided to make it a new block. I feel so epically trolled right now. Right, though? I thought you'd appreciate that. I accidentally have perfectly enough seared bricks. Like, literally exactly the right number. By mistake. Alright, so that is that. Let's get... Where's my bucket of fire holding? Where's my bucket bucket? The other bucket know. bucket. You probably put it on the floor behind you. Probably. So good news, buddy. We have a smeltery up and running. What? What? All the hype. Uh, go get some iron. If you wish. Yeah, go ahead, pop it in. Nice, dude. I should make two blocks of iron, by the way. What? Uh, we need copper and aluminum to make brass. Uh, for aluminum brass? Yeah. Uh, I believe that's correct. Yes, three aluminum for one copper. Not bad, right? Um, so I'm thinking we might want more lava sooner than later. I might work on upgrading and making more crucibles at the moment. Oh, nice. They uh, changed the Tinker's Construct mechanic so it doesn't harden into a block immediately. Yeah, and it looks nice too, doesn't it? Doesn't yeah, that's a really cool effect. Off. Looks really good. Yeah, I definitely like how that looks. Oh, it even has a variable mix rate. Yes. Like when you're making an alloy. Absolutely. Yes. Neat, right? It's a really nice touch.
All right, I got an us in ingot cast. Nice, dude. Well done, sir. We can make uh, some pretty nice tools, by the way. Don't go too crazy with the aluminum brass, by the way. I made, uh, I think, I don't know. A bunch? That's fine. It's enough that it should do all of our casting needs. Okay. Early game, uh, a really good metal to make liquid, or uh, to make tools out of, if you want to go tinker's tools, is um, bronze, which is copper and tin. Assuming there's tin in here somewhere. Nickel, gold, iron. Is there tin in this pack? I haven't seen tin. You know what? I remember there not being tin before, and I kind of wondered if he had added it. But well, we have, uh, I made 16 ingots of aluminum brass, so we have 15 left over. So bronze is an alloy of molten copper and molten tin, and tin you get from molten tin, and that's it. So I don't think tin exists. Silkworm is actually quite good. Man, look so at how do you feel about me on. getting rid of your um, hard work that you made over here? I'm fine with it. I'm trying to remember if flowing lava gets the same rate. So flowing lava is a rate of 2x, whereas... Oh no, it's 3x. That's cool. So flowing lava totally works. That's cool. Alright, I'm assuming you've got a bunch of iron here, correct? Yep. Where'd you put it? Over here? Cool. Yep. Okay. Uh, so I'd like to make iron mesh. Go nuts, man. Okay, so iron stiffen mesh is four iron. I'm gonna make two of them, does that sound cool? Go nuts, man. Okay, uh, we've got some string still. Could you get like a bajillion string from a single tree? So here's two iron stiffened mesh. So I might want to make a third just so we stick to what we're used to doing. Um, let's do that. Yeah, let's go with three because we're gonna get, well, no, I think I think two will be good for now. Yeah. But we're gonna upgrade this to three eventually. Good deal, buddy. Go nuts. So there you go. If you use iron stiffened mesh, you get better stuff now. Need even more iron. Yeah, I definitely want to use that, so that's cool. I got a bunch of uh, dust to sift through the iron stiffened mesh. Nice, yes, dust would be good to sift. So, Dyer, since it's been so long since we've done a series, what have you done in the meantime? Oh, you know me. Keep him busy. Overwatch. A little bit of Overwatch. I mean, just a little bit. Like a, like a smidgen, if you will, of Overwatch like that has been played. Like several hours a day. Like, I wouldn't go that far, but yes. Who's your main? Soldier 76? No, Mercy. Oh, Mercy. Oh, I was going to say yeah. Soldier 76 because you're an old man. Oh, wow. But I guess oh, you yeah, like uh, Mercy because you want to carry the team. That's right. You figured it out. You, you know my secret. Do your shoulders hurt? No. Why do yours? Well, I was just wondering, you know, you're carrying everyone, so. Well, you're carrying me, buddy, so. That is true. Is this better? Wow, that open? really does go fast when we both clog it. Yeah. Not bad, right? Oh, we're getting yeah, glowstone, too? Yeah. Or is that Elorium? Uh, I don't know. You'll have to look. 
Ghost Town. Yeah. But we got some blaze nice. powder and two redstone. We got some redstone. Nice. We can set up automation now. We can't yet. We need another redstone. All right, back in a minute, guys. Uh, I think I'm ready to make some kind of automation -y thingy. I love it when you're technical. Thanks. Try and get us some diamonds. Okay, that would be gravel in those things. Yep. So check this out, Pahi. I'm going to automate it a little bit. Okay. Check this out. Hooray. Uh, nice, right? Item duct. Transfer node. Uh. And you're going to do something similar for lava production. Yes, sir. I got a diamond. Nice, dude. You're lucky, because those are pretty rare. Well, not as rare as saplings, but... Right. So that should work pretty well. Check it out, dude. What is up? Word. So if we want fluid conduits, we're totally going to need to use quartz. There's also fluid transfer nodes, which are totally a thing. Um, cobblestone, that's tiny. Party pickaxe is cool. Crystals, huh? I'm going to convert several of these chunks to actual ingots and blocks. Okay. So the problem with your setup here is that the cobblestone generator doesn't generate enough surplus cobble to actually crush. It will. How's this? Da -da -da. Fluid tank? Oh, you no. upgraded it. Yeah, tier two. Nice, right? It's still not 
filling the drawer. It will. It's got to oh, build a go. backlog. See, there's a. It keeps 64 in the transfer node, and now it'll uh, backstuff the drawer. And these things take a while to melt down anyway. But now we've got a, a fluid tank for all our lava needs, and Dyer knows what he's doing, Potty. Trust in the Dyer. Trust, trust in the Dyer. If there's anything I've learned from you is that you are very poor at planning. I mean, yes. I don't have a I don't have a rebuttal to that. By the way, with basic drawers, I don't know if you noticed, but it's shift click to pull out a full stack and single click to pull out a single item. I hadn't noticed that. Okay, good. Nice. Yeah, we're getting good stuff. Just be careful with mixing unless you intend to mix, right? Yep, no, I know. Okay, cool. Back in a minute, guys. Hey buddy. Hey buddy. What's cooking? Uh stone. I've been sieving like a madman. I bumped up our sieves to six, by the way. Six iron? Yeah. You madman. I am. I am. It's true. I'm out of control. But to be fair, I'm loving it. I'm not sure if what I'm about to do is a waste or is going to be really useful or not. But we're going to find out, like, super fast. Like, right now. We're doing it live. Yep. We're testing. Don't mind me, Pahimar. What are you doing? Automating all the things. Yeah, you would do that. Yeah. See? I see. So now you have it automatically pumping out ingots. Correct, sir. See the chest? Woot. I thought you'd like. And see in here, smeltery. Oh, so inputs. Yeah. So inputs there, and then outputs over here. Not bad, right? Shickety sweet. Super sweet? Shickety sweet. You can say that too if you wanted to and be weird about it, but... It's like, it's like 55. Uh, I'm going to borrow some of your seared bricks, by the way. Go for it. Okay. Because I think I can make this even better. Do you have any more of that aluminum brass stuff? Yes. Cool. Borrowing. So I may have done the wrong thing, Palmer. What'd you do? The wrong thing. You're so helpful in explaining it's things. Great. It's just incredible. Dude, we're up to six diamonds. That's awesome. That stuff grows fast over there, by the way, doesn't it? Gotta love Snad. Snad is the bomb. We are getting a copious amount of iron, by the way.
trying to find a slime ball is kind of ridiculous. Is it hard? What do you need it for? Uh, those, um, pads. What the, pads? The, um, vector things. Oh. By the way, totally cool this right here. You're in your glory. I'm having a good time, man. Automation is the name of the game. Desire level. That's why I enjoy playing Skyblock so much, by the way, is automation is fun. And I'm here like, I'm going to get sugar. And you're like, I just built the Eiffel Tower. Pretty much. And this is why you make me do the platforms. Are you serious? There's, a, there's not bees, but there's chickens? Yes, chickens. Oh. Recording. Cool. I was already recording. Of course you were. Yeah, I just wanted to hear everybody, everybody hear how long it takes you to actually like start recording. I was doing something. I know. Like, well, making I just the a bit taller. I noticed that. Thank you, sir. Yeah, I could make it even taller if you wanted. You're good. Crazy tall. Well, I mean, if you want to, want to, you can. But you don't have to right now. Well, we might end up making, like, multiple of them so that they have individual, um metal types that they're using. I think by the time we get to that level, we probably won't use smelteries anymore. Ooh, there's something even better. Oh yeah, I'll like probably do either a sag mill or something like that. So this should be better now. Nice. So I uh, tripled our output. I noticed that. Yeah, it'll it'll make output way faster. Totally awesome. By the way, the lever turns off the transfer node, so if you ever want to like manually do something, keep that in mind. Sounds good. Cool. So, dude, we have a lot of lava, by the way. We do. We have we have a really large amount of lava right now. Like I turned my back on this lava gen, and it was just like, hey, I'm gonna make just tons. Like, we've got almost 16 buckets over here, feeding into our smeltery, which will last a while. You've got all the lava inside the crucibles, which each holds about four buckets worth. And then we've got a bucket worth of lava in each transfer node, and we've got 16 more buckets in this fluid tank. So we are, like, killing it on lava, dude. I think we're uh, pretty close to the point where we can start doing some RF production to get some power going. Ooh. And then we can automate even further. Yeah, we're gonna quickly get into uh, mods I haven't played. Yeah, yeah, it's all good though. I'll uh, I'll help you out. Oh, you're so sweet. You'll have fun with it too. You'll love it. All right, so uh, I'm gonna sift a bunch of dust some more and get more things. I think redstone is something we're gonna definitely want more of. I think you get more redstone from the diamond mesh, but I don't know if we want to spend our diamonds to make a diamond mesh. What do you think? Hmm. Hmm, indeed. I'm definitely loving, like, the six at a time thing, though. It's the greatest for me. And I am having bad luck with redstone. 
That's the third or fourth stack in a row that I like sifted without getting any redstone in it. So uh, diamond luck. sieve would double our chance of redstone. I agree. But it would use what four diamonds? Yes. Yes. So I don't know. I don't know, Bahi. I don't know. We have six. Do we have a need for them anytime soon? Um, probably not. See, I just got zero redstone, so double zero is double. Like, it's still zero. So, I don't understand. Well, you're bad, and you should feel bad. I, I am bad, and I do feel bad. And we have eight stacks of cobble. Thank you, Direwolf, for the basic drawer and the upgraded cobblestone generator. And, dude, this is awesome. I'm loving this coolness right here that's going on. Isn't it great? It's, it's the auto smelting? Right. I'm very pleased. I'm very pleased with the auto smelting that's currently happening. I'll even leave um I'll leave one of the casting basins back here so that it's kind of ready if we ever decide to use it manually. That's interesting. The casting basins are a valid destination for items. All right, I think it's time to wrap up our episode, buddy. It is. Yeah. So next episode, we'll um, I'll do a bunch of hammering between episodes and sifting. And um, what what do you what do you what do you what do you, what what's happening right now? Stop! Stop doing what you're doing. I don't know what it is, but stop it. You're making me uncomfortable. I live to make you uncomfortable. I'm well aware of this fact. Oop. Ow! What is happening to me now? Um. Uh, someone threw fruit at you. Ouch! That was not very polite of that someone, and whoever they are should probably feel really bad about it. It's a drive by uh, fruiting. Wow. Harsh. Alright, wrapping up point. That was my signing off. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Take it easy. Bye bye, everyone. Hey!